Hi everybody and welcome back to our Scientifics Direct video series. Um, this week I brought along my buddy Josh, he's going to help me because this experiment is set up for kids. This is our egg science kit. Uh, it has six, as it says, excellent experiments for us to do. We're going to try to do a couple of them here for you just to kind of show what the kit comes with and what you can expect. This is a great activity to do with your kids. Keep them busy, it's a little bit rainy here today, um, so that's why we brought in Josh to, to try to help us out. And as you see, this kit comes with everything that you need to do the six experiments. The only thing you need to provide is the egg, and for one of the experiments we're going to do is some water as well. Uh, other than that, everything you need is right here. It comes with some vinegar, some salt, uh, and a couple of uh, accessories here that you'll be doing with it. So what do you think, Josh? You ready to go? Yeah! Okay. So, I want to see, can you get this egg to balance on its end, kind of like this one is, the plastic one. Okay. Can you get it to stand on itself? No? No. No? Do you need some help? Let me show you a trick. Yeah, put okay. salt on it. Yeah, we're going to put some salt yeah. and then we'll take underneath. The salt off and see if it will work. So let's see if we can get it to work. So what the experiment tells us to do is put a little bit of salt down. And put it on the salt. And then we put the egg down on the salt to get it to balance. Now take that straw and lean in close and see if you can get the salt to blow away. You might have to get up on your knees there hey. and help out. Doing good. Keep blowing. Blow all the salt away. Great job. Is the egg still standing? Yeah. That's a pretty cool trick, isn't it? Yeah. Awesome. Do you think you could do it without the salt? Yeah. No, it's too hard, right? No. Okay. So, what do you think? Was that a good first experiment? Yeah. Okay. So we've reset here, we've gotten rid of the salt uh, off the table, and we're going to do our second experiment. You ready, Josh? Yeah. Okay. So, I'm going to pour some water in our beaker here okay. that our kit came with, and we're going to see if this egg floats or sinks. What do you think it's going to do? I think it will sink. You think it's going to sink? Okay. Why don't you drop that egg in there and see what happens. See if your hypothesis is right. Yes! You were right. So what do you think we could do to make this egg float, Josh? Do you have uh, any ideas? Salt. Salt? Salt. Right, and gave us some salt. So let's give it a try here and see what happens. So we're going to take the egg out. I'll get the salt. Okay, you get the salt ready. And we're going to add three big spoonfuls in there. Okay. That's one. Let me help you here. I'll get the other ones in there. Got them out. Two. Which one's this one? Three. Three. Now stir it up. Can you stir it up for me? Yep. Get all the salt to dissolve. Where's the egg? I took the egg out so we can stir it real good here for us and then we'll drop it in and we'll see what happens, okay? okay? Let me give it a quick stir, make sure everything's dissolved in there as best we can. It's like making an omelet like at a house. House or making a scrambled eggs just it's a just a science experiment. A science stuff. experiment stuff, great. Yeah. Let's drop the egg in. Let's see. It's it's floating a little bit. It's starting to float, and as the salt dissolves, it's going to continue to move up. We'll stir it here in a second, but what's happening, Josh, is the water's becoming okay. more dense so that the egg is able to float because it's less dense. Yeah. It's lighter in the water. It's like you do not need to use the force anymore uh, or because... You want to use the force to get it to go no, up? No, I mean, like, you do not need to use the force because it's already spinning and now it's going to float up because we stirred up the salt. We use science we, to get it to float. So, Josh, we stirred up the water, and what's happening to our egg now? Uh, it's not really floating, it's but... It's floating. How yeah, awesome is that? Are I, you using the force to make it float? No. No? What did we use? Did we, science. We use science, you're right. And yeah. the science is we put salt in there and the water became more dense. And yeah. that makes the egg less dense. And when something's less dense, it floats all the way to the top. Whoa. So Josh, ready for our third experiment? Yep. Yeah. Okay. We're going to try to balance it to have it fall in the water. What do you think? Yeah. So we're going to put this 
piece of cardboard on it and the tube that it comes with yeah. will balance the yeah. egg right and on the top. See if it falls down again like so when hypothesis. I pull, your hypothesis, right. So when I pull on this, yeah. what do you think is going to happen to the egg? Do you think it's going to flip all over the place and crack on your head? No. No? What's going to happen? Because we're going to do science. Think I think it will fall down because of gravity. It will stay away where it is, but it will just have to fall but down. But it will fall straight down? Yeah, because it has gravity. Right, so let's give it a try. Can you say three, two, one for me? Three, two, one, blast off! <gasps> it worked! And we kept the salt in the water, so what is it doing? It's floating! High five, nice! Great job. Thanks for helping me out this week, Josh, and thanks for watching our video with our egg science experiments. If you have anything you want to see tested, please put it in the comments or email us directly and we'll see you back next week. One last thing before we go though, our school's out promo code is still working. We've extended it through the 4th of July weekend, so this will be working through Monday. So free shipping on us, $65 or more, use the source yep. code SCHOOLS OUT. Thanks again and we'll see you next week. Yep. Yep. And don't forget to watch our video.